Okay. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm. Mm. Okay. Alright guys and girls, welcome back to another quick live stream, or a live stream for a little bit. Depends how long we can do this for, at, uh, what time is it? It's 4.03, Sunday 29th of August 2021, at the time of the video. Alright, see how, well, I've got this at 720p. Due to the fact that, well, live streaming it this way uh, will lessen down um, the speed a little bit. Um, won't take up too much bandwidth, so I've got to do flight simulator as well. Alright. Mm. So, welcome, welcome all, guys and girls. Hope you're all doing good today or this morning, I should say. Uh, also, we've got the green screen effect uh, that I'm using. Got this for a whole year, so um, I think I, I don't know how much I paid for. I think like 18, 25 quid or something. But what we've got here is got the throttle, and then we've got the the stick to go with it as well with the Thrustmaster T16000. Uh, the M T A uh, yeah, T sixteen thousand M series. So we'll soon um, see if this is any good. So what we'll do, um, Simon? It's actually nearly five o'clock. Actually, almost nearly five. What am I saying? Yeah, no, actually, no, nearly. 10 minutes past four then should be good okay so it's flight simulator now on xbox for you xbox gamers out there as well and i'll tell you what it's worth picking up um the xbox series s is like um 300 quid 299 pound um and it's worth it for the s series entirely Right. Uh, probably do some short runs or short flights today, this morning, and I can see of how I can control this starting off. Uh, we've also got the the like rudders as well um, on the stick, so you can turn the stick itself and twist it, and that basically is your rudder. Um, or you can put your rudders in. I haven't got them plugged in at the moment. So, uh, what we oh, what's this? Um, got anything in the marketplace? Just been added to new stuff. So, I'll look. Oh, forty percent off. Elizabeth Field Airport. How much is it normally? Four pound nineteen. Uh, S sixty nine Lincoln Airport. Uh, oh, this looks nice actually. Cat K Airport. Uh, there's a lot of deals on at the moment. We've got uh, Nice Cote d'Azur Airport. Um, no idea where that is, but got Rome as well. 
uh, quite a lot of few deals on today uh, Jundai Airport Hong Kong City Times might pick that up in a couple of weeks uh, it's a 4.5 out of 5, so that's not too bad considering. Uh, ooh, it's just the 339 Pan aircraft. So they've got a few like bits and bobs here. Uh, Guadalajara International Airport. So a lot of companies are starting to do a lot of stuff now. New planes here as well. A10 Thunderbolt. I think that will be my next plane to get at some point. Also, we've got Aerolite 103. Looks like a glider of some sort. Um, we've got a Amphibious Ultralight Flying Boats. An Atlanta Night Enhanced. Ooh, Atlanta. Uh, and we've got a Britain Norman BN2 Islander. Ooh, what the hell? Bowen 77200 ER what 25 quid that's not bad it's not bad at all oh wow some images on it actually what's it sound inside of there so a bin inside not bad oh wow They've actually done the interiors as well, so you can pretty much go inside then. That's pretty cool. It's nice photos there. So they give you like a thing of what it looks like um, entirely of what it looks like inside. That's pretty cool. I'm probably going to get some of these like in a couple of weeks' time. But for now, uh, let's get in test out this uh, throttle controller. Now we want to oh, get a Textron Cessna Citron uh, Citation um, Longitude. Yeah, we'll get this one. Um, we'll test this one out. And liveries. Oh, wow, look at that. What's that one? Orbit. Global Freeways. What's the altitude on these ones? 45,000. Jesus. Okay, I like that red one. We'll go for the red one. Um, <clears throat> we'll go live. And we will go for... Let's have a look. Um... Uh, Um, Stansted, London, maybe? I don't know, because it's going to be a bit dark, I think. And is it going to be dark still there? Yeah, still night time. Um, so I would probably go for... About Charles de Gaulle. Uh, it's still dark over there at the moment as well. Um... Uh, I mean, we've got the whole world to go to. So, actually, why don't we go to... Let's type in... Uh... Oh, what's that? Oh, what's that? Oh, what's that? Uh... No, that's some hell someone. Actually, we'll put Australia in. See what we get. Ah, Sydney. Kingsford Smith. Because it'd be, what time is it over there at the moment? So, it's one thirteen. If we're right, one thirteen. Actually, no, 3, three twelve. So that would that be right? Three twelve UTC. Universal time, I think it is, isn't it? 
Uh, we'll try that. <clears throat> we'll try the citation or citation. I mean, I would live stream like for hours upon hours myself and do lots of stuff, but because um, of so much work I'm actually behind and all that and what I've got to do as well, um, I'm sort of like juggling work at the moment, so. Right. Oh, look at that plane. Hang on, how can I change this? No, it's not allowing me to change the bloody plane for some reason. The camera on it. Showcase. And on. And let me just go to drone mode and external. Oh no, showcase. Uh, drone. Um, and it's not allowing me to. <clears throat> ah, and on, I got it. I know what I was doing. And on external. There it goes, because I'm using the actual thing itself. So, that's a nice little plane. Nice little plane. They've done the internals as well. Maybe not. Bit laggy for some reason. Okay, so. Bring back that slightly a bit. Can we trim that out a little bit as well? Right, we need to trim this out a minute, guys and girls. <coughs> right, here we go. And then, oh, I just make sure we don't go into the water. And on, let's try and straighten this bloody plane out. Here we go. So, I'm not sure where that go up. And it automatically does it, uh, the trimming on this, for some reason. Right, so let's go down a little bit. Oh, wow. That looks amazing. Okay. So we are using the T16000M from Thrustmaster. Um, when I sort of like was watching Mr. 4K Upscaler's um, video because he bought it himself and all that, I thought, oh, that looked nice. That looked nice. Uh, so I kind of sort of took the, the plunge um, and just purchased it. And yeah, it looks brilliant. I should look it down slightly. Like that. I shrink that plan a little bit. Let's drop the, the planes. Uh, 
Okay. Let's turn the plane. Oh, actually, I did forget to put my rudders up. Um. Gives me an idea, right? So I want to put my uh, flaps up. Uh, actually, controls actually. Controls. Uh, T16000 joystick M or M. Um, so I need to sort of like, right? So f landing, ah, landing gears. So flap number four. So what's number four on the Ah, so that's okay. So that by looks of it then is already set for me. Sorry, that I don't. I don't. Ah, okay. So that's already set for me for the landing gears. So the landing gears and what about the flaps? Some of flaps, 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 flaps. Oh, what do I keep going in there for? Uh, so, what's my flaps? Um, why is it taking a long time? There we go. Um, flight controls, landing gears, management. Actually, we'll put in flaps. <coughs> Flaps, flap, 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 flaps. Um, crunch, um, flaps, decrease, control service, uh, set engine, co flaps. Now, I think actually, I think the flaps. Is it on? Is it there? No. Ah, there we go. So that's the flaps. Is the, the button on the throttle gauge. So basically, once you put up the Once I go down, I got my wheels come out. That's my landing gear, and I can put it back in straight away. But the, when you're flying, when you're taking off, you're supposed to sort of bring up your landing gears up so that way um, they don't get broken or damaged or. Uh, Right, so let's go a bit out of set. Right. Right. Let's go. Oh, so let's go over here. I should see if there's anything nearby. Mm. Landing gear. I've already put the landing gear. Up. 
already got my landing gear. Oh, what the hell? Went too, too deep on that one. So I've got my webcam up there with the green screen effect on there from Vcam as what I'm using at the moment. Um, actually, let's quickly change. The, oh, let's have a look. Let's click that out. Okay, let's go to the main menu a minute. Uh, I want actually I want to try one of my fa fast planes, ones I bought yesterday. Um, with this whole flight stick um hopefully it gives me some like decent uh flight with it um and also what's my profile at the moment 71 hours i've done on it so far 71 hours out of 100 hours is my next goes 100 hours okay so oh got some people where about this um another part of the world is it Camden, oh Sydney Opera House, um, okay so we could technically actually technically we could fly set as a departure and we'll go to the Sydney Opera House um, and what we need to do, um, yeah, oh Textron Aviation That's the, the texture, isn't it? But what we need to do, let's have a look for a nice speedy plane I bought yesterday. Um, where is that one I bought yesterday? Uh, actually, I suppose we could actually could use a helicopter. Oh, no, would that be a bit too far? I think it would be a bit too far away. With that one, we'll just get the DC Designs F15C out fighter jet, um, and we'll put on. We'll use the 30 second AOS, and we'll go into real settings, real time settings, settings, and then we will fly off on there, and then we'll see how well we get on it. Mm. But yeah, anyway, guys and girls, if you enjoy these sort of flights, let us know as well in the comments below, whether you're on Twitch or whether you're on YouTube. I do both. And this is my um, Twitch channel, but my YouTube channel is uh, Anthony Kenneth Bishop, one word. Okay, let's, let's get this baby up. Okay. So I've got to turn the plane around. This is going to be good. Alright, there we go. Let's get 
10. Let's actually straighten that plane out a little bit. So I think it takes a couple of minutes. Let's go down a little bit. Try and keep that in. Actually, need to get the some reason the landing gears are not going down. And this is a part of because. Um, it's probably because it's just been made. Oh, and I'm a spiky lag. Okay, so there's quite a few people out of Sydney, uh, around Sydney already. Let's get down and look. See what the textures are like on it. Because I was thinking if I used the helicopter it would take me ages to get there. Unless I had a fast helicopter but it still wouldn't be fast enough. Almost that to the Sydney Opera House, guys and girls. I can actually sit now in my line of sight almost. Look at that. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Okay, we'll go down a bit. Look at that. Oh, beautiful. In a minute, in a minute, in a minute. Right, a minute, guys and girls, and on. Almost. Huh? Every minute, every minute. Give me, give me five minutes. Huh? Uh, so just get along here a minute, guys and girls. And uh, we'll come back round for a second look. But we are actually using the, the joystick. T16000 to basically and on and on and on and on right and on right anyway guys and girls look at that beautiful 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 look at that woohoo right, let's just crash this a minute actually we can my god don't you can't even crash it what the hell I mean it's this great and uh, let's see if we how fast will this go so can we go up to the skies? Because I think it's got a maximum of 60,000 60, knots um, for altitude. So 
So we've got about 60,000. So that's 15,000. We're just going up into the clouds, baby. Um, almost 20,000. Come on. My God, we're getting out there really fast and quick. Come on, come on, we can do it. 60,000. There we go. Come on, there we go, come on. Come on. Come on. 25,000. 26. 27,000. 28,000. 29, come on. That's 30,000. Come on. Come on. Let's lift this up a bit more so we can push it to the up. Boundaries. Come on. And all the way up to 40,000. See if this actually does go up to 60,000. Come on, come on. We can push it. We can push it, come on. Come on, come on. Keep going, keep pushing. Keep pushing, keep. Oh, it's let me down at 50,000, what the hell? So we've got nearly 50,000 out of it. So almost 50,000, not quite, I think it was like 48,000, 47,000 feet before it started, like, there we go. There we go, he's gonna die. He's gonna die! Nose straight through, nose dive right through to the ground uh, with it. Come on. I mean, come on, this reminds me of um, some good flight games from Ace Combat 7, to be honest. Okay, there we go. We're gonna. Smack into the ground. There we go. Oh, anyway, guys and girls, cheers for watching this. If you enjoy it, a uh, couple like minutes on it, uh, give us a big like and all of that. Favorite, share, comment, subscribe. Sort of checking out uh, to see if this works and all of that. Seems to work fairly, fairly well. Um, and it's like, yeah, it's pretty good, that show. I mean, uh, the throttle itself, it's very smooth. Sometimes you feel it's not, like, moving, but it's moving backwards and forwards. It's fine. It's fantastic. Um, and also, you put your hand on the, the stick itself, it lights up like a Christmas tree, um, like an orangey, glowy light. So that's pretty cool. But anyway... Cheers for watching, guys and girls, for the 20 August, the 29th, Sunday, the 29th of August, 2021, at the time of the video. Do give a big like, favourite, share, comment, subscribe. I'm done for 34 minutes or so on here, but I will be doing some more of these later on. But stay safe all, and I'll see you on the next episode.